When we return, it's a battle where the participants will need to know where they are at all times. Like they don't in other battles. It'll be the Wyatt family versus the Brothers of Destruction. This match is going to raise the bar for our business. I'd like to remind everyone that this matchup is brought to you courtesy of my friends at 2K Sports. Wait a minute, Cole. You've got friends at 2K Sports? Somebody wrote that script for me. Don't change that channel. This match is sure to be an instant classic. see another hot one. Those eyes tell the story of somebody hell-bent on picking up the win here tonight.
It's go time, and nobody can get in that ring and go like The Undertaker. I don't know if there's a bigger advantage a team can have. This one could be the match of the night. Nobody can hold a candle to me in the APA, but I expect this tag team match to be decent at least. And hey, I still can't believe they pay me for this. Back inside the ring now. Okay, guys, I wanted to talk a little bit about Bray Wyatt here. As we know, here in the WWE, a manager is commonplace, and in that tradition, he seems to have taken a liking to someone's services. Bray Wyatt alone is intimidating. Bray Wyatt plus one has to be plain nerve-wracking for these guys. I really think that this duo is ready to take the WWE by storm. Well, I've never seen him do that before. stands six foot five and 275 pounds his eerie demeanor aside Luke Harper's strength quickness and brutality is something that's very difficult to go up against and he doesn't waste any time Luke Harper goes right after his opponents it's downright scary making a statement here seen it a little more often. You know, Cole, it's frightening how Luke Harper uses all of his abilities to ravage an opponent. The strength, the speed, the obsession with human annihilation, and we didn't get into the real scary stuff yet. That's over 300 pounds it just took to the air on that drop kick. Destructive. Now, why did he do that? A move like that's low. It's appalling, if you ask me. Totally disrespectful. Well, when he sees the belt, he likes to hit below it. When Luke Harper enters the venue, a chilling hush comes over the entire building. The audience in the WWE locker room is waiting to witness a hellacious mauling. Rest assured, Harper's assault will not be for the faint of heart. Oh my, The Undertaker. Uh-oh, there's the finisher. This might be over, and I mean all over. He's okay, he's okay. He just took a bad step, no big deal. Can we face facts, please? They don't have just one opponent to worry about. They have two. Looking at it here. I think this is it. You know, Michael, you can see what happens to an audience when that Wyatt family is lurking. There's no doubt that Luke Harper walks at the same haunting pace as their entrance music. And it scares the you-know-what out of everyone, including Harper's opponent. Kane showing some expert prowess here. Look out. Good Lord, that wasn't even close. So that's what it's like being so far off the mark. Every time he has to get up, it takes more and more effort. Nobody controls the pace of a match. He's doing everything he can to get his bearings back here. Otherwise, this match could be over sooner than anyone could have anticipated. Yeah, Cole, this is when you have to settle things down. Get the blood. I don't know how he can counter this. I don't know how he's going to get out of this here. You see the haunting effect Luke Harper has on WWE fans and its roster of superstars. Just look into the audience when the 6'5", 275-pound horror show makes his way to the ring. It's immediate terror. Well, you said it, Cole. The lights go out in an arena when Luke Harper makes his way to the ring. That's when Fright Night begins. And after seeing him dismantle his opponent, you see the lights go out for whoever Luke Harper ripped apart in the ring. Now check that out. We have a first here this evening. That was awesome. Really pushing his opponent to the limit here. He 
It could be over here. Yeah, maybe. Two, three. They did it. They won the match. Here are your winners, The Undertaker and Kane, the Brothers of Destruction. You want to talk about a tag team war? We most definitely witnessed just that. This was from bell to bell, a clinic in tag team wrestling. Kudos to everyone. I love tag team matches, and that was one of the best I've seen in a while. I strongly suggest Luke Harper go back and watch this match. There's plenty that can be learned from this loss. Yeah, you can bet they're going to be talking about this match for quite some time.